Underground trains started running under the streets of London in January 1863, the first service of its kind anywhere in the world. Deep under London, you see here the famous tunnelling shield designed by Sir Mark Isambard Brunel. It was a temporary support structure for the tunnel while it was being excavated. This made construction under the Thames possible with deep level tubes. Without the construction of the tunnelling shield, it would not have been possible for the first electric train to make its journey along the new underground line. These promotional postcards were for Central London Railway in 1902. Underneath, you see one of the first underground tube maps, showing an early design which was produced by map printers Waterloo and Sons in 1908. Going through the construction of King's Cross Station, we find ourselves at the end of the line and see the finished model of the recent underground train on the line which is used every day to support London's ever-growing economy. If you ever wake from your sleep and you hear someone softly weep, honey, it's only me moaning for you. Change the house.